I think the number one factor that contributes to student success is high expectations. Anytime you're challenging a student to go beyond what they normally do, just giving them that gentle nudge out of their comfort zone into a new area, uh, I think that is really important. I think uh, if you look around at any th program or a classroom that where students excel, you'll always see a teacher that expects and believes in their students and expects them to do great things. I've created different whiteboards that can be put on the desks, that can be wheeled around the room, wheeled up in front of the students, uh, conference pods that go on the walls so students can do peer editing, you know, create games and do other learning. Um, so that's one thing that, I, that I've done that I've, I, I'm really happy with and uh, that was a lot of fun to do. There's a quote that I love, it's, uh, teaching is not a lost art, but the regard for it is a lost tradition. I think any time that in, uh, you have any sort of circumstance with which uh, teachers are honored, I think it's important. And I think there's a lot of teachers out there that deserve recognition as well. And so I think it's important for teachers to be acknowledged and I would encourage people to, uh, to nominate someone if you think uh, you have a deserving individual, definitely. Being a teacher is uh, a lot of work. Um, and no matter what, the job is never finished. There's always something to do. And it always feels like, you know, the minute you're done one task, there's another one put on your desk. But I think it's really important for educators to just stop, smell the roses, appreciate the journey. Um, you know, it, what, someday you'll look back and it'll be the good old days. So you're living the good old days right now. So it's important to just step back and realize that, you know, someday you're going to look back and realize that these are the good old days.